This is Gene Key, KDDD News. NewsChannel10.com reports another death while in Amarillo police custody. An Amarillo woman dies in police custody from what appears to be alcohol-related causes. 46-year-old Tara Leanne Miller was arrested Monday in Amarillo on a pedestrian in the roadway charge. Tuesday morning, Miller collapsed in jail and was rushed to the hospital where she later died. The Randall County Sheriff's Office says it is still investigating the incident. ConnectAmarillo.com reports a white deer woman charged with stealing more than $200,000 from a Carson County company turned herself into authorities Tuesday after a nearly one-year theft investigation. Stephanie Davis, 42, is charged with theft over $200,000, a first-degree felony. She was released on a $10,000 bond Tuesday after she was arraigned on the charge at the Carson County Law Enforcement Center. Davis is a former employee of Scarab Manufacturing, a White Deer-based composting company. The charge carries a possible prison term of 5 to 99 years. ConnectAmarillo.com reports high winds in the area led to wind turbines shutting themselves down all across the Panhandle Monday. Gusts of more than 55 miles per hour can damage a wind turbine and become a safety concern, said A.J. Swoop, the executive director of Class 4 Winds and Renewables. The turbines will shut themselves down because they can't handle that amount of wind. Thanks to advances in forecasting, utility companies and wind farms are better able to prepare for high winds. And in case you forgot to mark this on your calendar, Dumas City election will be May 12th. The general election will be held for City Commissioner Place 1 and City Commissioner Place 2. Also, Dumas Independent School District will fill the positions currently held by three members, Brent Clark, Kirk Pope, and Johnny Schmucker. Voting will take place between 7 a.m. and 7 p.m. at Dumas Junior High School, East 5th Street and Maddox Avenue on May the 12th. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDDD News.